how to make the login into SCPS for Ana Cloud Edition with YPath, it's really simple. So after creating a project in YPath Studio, let's use first the use application browser activity and let's indicate to it the login page. So let's indicate. Then we need to fill the email and click on this button. So for that, let's use first the type into activity to fill the email input field. And let's so here indicate the user account, well, the user email, so the email of our account. And then we will use the click activity to click so on the continue button. So let's indicate here the button to the activity. And let's just run to see how it's working. So let's click here to run. And it's working. So now appears this page from where we have to fill the password and then click on the sign in button. So let's uh, use another type into activity. And let's indicate here the input field. And let's confirm. And now let's just uh, put here the password. And of course, ideally, we will put it on a credential on the vault storage where we could store it on a secure place. But to keep it simple for this tutorial, let's indicate here directly. And then we need to click on the sign in button. So let's click here on sign in, confirm. And that's it basically. Uh, so now let's just go back here. So let's just go back. Uh, and better, we can even uh, here close the browser. So let's just run and see how it's working. So we can see that we got uh, this invalid link thing. So the reason is that uh, we should here indicate the endpoint to our SAP S4 and cloud uh, instance. So here on the use application browser, let's uh, here on the URL property pass the endpoint to our instance. And let's run now. So let's uh, run again. And now it's working. So it will be done the sign in. And we can see the browser was closed. So why that happened? So we can see here on the use application browser uh, two properties, the open and close. And here we can control whether the use application browser opens or closes the browser. So on open, by default is if it not open, uh, the page already, it will be opened. So we can leave with that. Then the close, uh, if was opened by the app browser, this use application browser will let us close it. So here, let's just set to never and let's run again and see if the browser page keeps open. So we can see if the login was done successfully. And now it will work. And here you can see that the login was done successfully into SCPS for an cloud edition. And that's it for this tutorial. If you liked it, please give a thumbs up. And now consider to subscribe to the channel and enable notifications bell so you don't miss any tutorial released here on the channel.